good morning from Newquay in Cornwall. I just thought I'd make a, a little video uh, just to show you some of the equipment and some of the, the cool places uh, where we normally snorkel. Look at this awesome light today. It wasn't supposed to be sunny, so this is a bit of a bonus. Um, so cool, yeah, you know, obviously don't need all this stuff for snorkeling, um, but I'm starting to get a bit into free diving, so a lot of this stuff's quite handy. Um, we've got some big fins, nice and long to get down nice and deep. Uh, weight belt as well, obviously. Your weight, your wetsuit that we use is full of lots of tiny little bubbles, so that actually makes you float quite a lot, which sounds good. But if you're free diving and you want to get down, obviously it isn't, so a bit of weight helps. And snorkel and mask. And this is my normal snorkeling snorkel. Um, but today I'm going to try out this really simple free diving one, which is literally just a tube. Um, knife for fighting sharks, so for um, just precautionary, just to cut yourself out of any fishing wire in case you got caught down the bottom or anything like that. Um, and then lastly, I've got my float as well, which I put along with me, um, and you'll see how that gets set up when we're out there as well. Um, uh, oh yeah, actually, no, lastly is my little sea scooter, but obviously you don't need that. I just got really lazy now, so I'm just going to use that to zoom out to my little dive site. All Taiwan headland. You've got a little fistral to surf over there. We've got the gazel. As you can see, it's low tide. This is the old lifeboat launch station. Look at that. Meow. So at high tide, it's normally about there, and you can just walk in nicely. But low tide, it goes right down to the bottom end. So down there, it's only going to be about two meters deep. So we're probably going to have to swim out to that sea scooter out to that green boy out there to get some kind of decent depth to free dive um, and then we're going to kind of get in over there where the divers normally get in right well i'll get my kit on and I'll, we'll get out there cool so we got in um really clear water today really nice loads of stuff People don't realise how much and how colourful it is, even in Britain. There's loads to look at, loads of different coloured seaweeds. Let's have a little, uh, a little dive under the water. So we've come away, we've arrived at our dive site now, come away from the shore a little bit, there's that slipway over there and the water's a little bit deeper now. You probably can't see on the camera but it's just about visible, so probably about four or five metres depth. So this is my little setup here, so I've got little clips on the handles. Attach that to the, all these D-rings. Got my little flag here. Don't kill me with your jet ski. That is, I've got 50 meters of line in here. Just coming out, going to a clip. And then I've got my weight, which I'm going to use as an anchor. So. Clip here onto that clip. And then I'm going to unclip the weight and we're going to pay it out and it's just going to slip down to the bottom. And I'm going to count on my rope. I've got markers here. Every blue is a meter and every black is five meters. So it's going to pay out. Uh, some rope until that. I feel that anchor hit the bottom and then I'm going to tie the rope off. So 
I'll just show you paying that out and letting it go. Cool. So seven meters, seven meters of water. We're in here. This is about what 21, 22, 23 foot. Probably over exaggerating there. And then what I do, anchors on the bottom. I now tie it off underneath here. Here we go. Just a clove hitch there. And now we've got a nice line to dive down. And we've got a station that we can leave. Got my sea scooter clicked on. That's not going anywhere. I can have a little snorkel around. We'll have a little free dive down the line. Look at this, why would you want to live here? <laughs> 